Hollow. And hello. Thank you. Thank you for joining me today. So I'm trying to look up like Germany's national anthem just to listen to that, to react to that. It turns out Germany has kind of a complicated history and uh, the answers are, I don't know, difficult to fully understand for a simple American like me. I mean, I found this song. Uh, this is like, this was the East Germany anthem. You know, it's about rise. It's, I mean, it's called Risen from Ruins. Basically, I hope it's not like an offensive song. I don't know. <laughs> like, I don't know. That's the song Hitler's mom played to rock him to sleep every night. Just it coming out of my speakers, I have to smash it with a hammer now. Like, I'm sorry. I'm stupid, but hopefully, I don't know. Offerstanden aus Ruinen. Let's listen. Hmm. Okay. I guess this is East Germany. United Fatherland. I like that one guy. <laughs> Old woes are to be overcome. This song is pretty hype. I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm kind of focused on reading the lyrics, but... The orchestra is, is beautiful. That's a cool shot. It's interesting how you can tell just from like the architecture and these videos that it's um, East Germany. Are these from like a movie or are these just actual? I mean, I know a lot of these clips look look real and then some of them are almost like it's from a movie. A free generation raises up. Hmm. Interesting. Damn. I'll tell you, you guys know how to make a hype like um like anthem whether it's for war or the anthem of the country or whatever. I mean, I just had to say 
That was epic. I don't know what they were. I mean, I do know what they were saying. Granted, the translation is correct. <laughs> Hopefully. I was just kidding about Hitler's mom, by the way. This song wasn't written until... I mean, I don't. I guess it wasn't written until 1949. So there you go. Um, that was interesting. It was sort of interesting how so much of it talked about the children and they're the future and they're going to build it like to be wonderful and we're going to be united and... Um, it was a song more about the future, you know, because I, at times were, at, at times, times were tough, I think, <laughs> from what I, from what I do know in East Germany. Um, so they're really singing about, you know, hopes for the future. It was a really, I thought it was a nice song. Let me see what the top comment is. So that a mother never mourns her son again. Wow. That lyric kind of went over went past me. I mean, now that they now that I read it again, I remember that part. I didn't realize until I read it again like that's wow, that's powerful. Germany 100% should have taken this anthem. Hmm. Okay, so good news is the people love this anthem, so I'm not like some jerk over here talking about how great this song is even though it's you know offensive or something it's not apparently <laughs> okay guys i don't know i thought it was beautiful yeah that that would make an awesome that makes an awesome for an awesome anthem and the fact that i mean the anthem hasn't even been used since 1990 there 1990 and yet this video has 3.6 million views, so clearly people like this song. Uh, I'm going to have to listen to the, the... I mean, I'm just searching it. I guess it's this one, right? Is this the correct German national anthem? Because then when I searched Google, the thing is, it said... First of all... What's the name? What's the name? See, like, what's this? The national hymn. Oh, the national hymn. <laughs> um, yeah, here, Wikipedia. It says this is the national anthem, or this. Das Leider. And, you know. Um, wait, am I stupid? Yes. Okay, so this is the correct one. I guess. They just put a DOS at the beginning of it. Whereas this one doesn't have the DOS, but it does over here. I don't know. But I, I yes, this is clearly the correct national anthem. So I'll take a listen to this <laughs> next time or something. Uh, okay, uh, I've rambled on about nothing. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.